smiling. Oh yeah. <laughs> At last. I'm always smiling. <laughs> oh, that driver. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I get that off who misses. <laughs> Eight in a row, Sean. A win and win anyway. Is it you said to the players? Eight in, you know. Eight, go for others. Yeah. Is it? I didn't know that. Uh, yeah. Um, did what to say half time or full time? Yeah. Full time, just what I'm going to say here. It's, um, I'm not really bothered how we play in a game like that. Play great and we win great. If we play poor and win, we just want to get two points. It's a big, big game and um, the credit, lots of credit needs to go to St. Helens and and what, what Jam has done there, he's created a good spirit and they had a real dig at us. You know, it's not always a massive advantage having a having a player sent off. Well, you know, when you're when you're the team that's not had him sent off. So you know the the uh, there's things you can do which help you, as we found out in that grand final as well when we lost Benny. So, you know, overall really happy the two points, but I wanna give a lot of credit to St. Helens. I thought they dug in deep. Come on, Phil. I cannot win with that one. I don't know. It's a tough one. You know, they've missed a few the last few weeks, and you know, I'd rather not to not comment on that. You seem to get a lot of joy down your left edge there, right edge. Sean. Was that something you you worked up before the game or something? That... Yeah, it was. It was. Um, there was a few other areas which we didn't really exploit, which, are, especially them losing a man, it's a real simple game plan when they lose a man, but. We didn't really get it in the second half, it was a lot better after half time, but I want to fix it from minute one when they lose a man if, they, if it happens again. So I thought we could have been a bit smarter, but I thought we scored some good tries. I thought a couple of their tries were just unacceptable from us. Liam Farrell, I thought Liam Farrell was good. Uh, I thought Locker was good in his spell. Um, you know, having them four players back from injury, I thought they played tough. There's a risk to that. Um, having all four players in the team, especially one that's not played for a long, long time. So there's a risk. So I thought they all had a dig and put their hand up. And Sam Powell played tough. Liam Farrell I thought it was great. Some finish from Liam Marshall for that try in the corner. Yeah, I love showing off Marsha. <laughs> Makes it a bit more dramatic. Yeah, he's, he's good. good. I thought Tom Davis was good on the other wing. I thought he made some good metres in yardage. I thought he was very good. You know, but the Saints had some players what were outstanding today, I thought. It was, good, it was a good derby. The wingers are really making you, you, you must be making you think like, when you get players back, because like, as I say, you put budget in the centre, are you doing all right? Yeah, they're good, doing well, Tim, I'm, I'm, I'm impressed and credit to everybody what, what, what's coached them as youngsters to come into our team and they show up well and they're playing very confident, so I'm, I'm, I'm happy, very, very happy. We just need to do it again in a few, a few more days. Rounds off a good week with George Williams coming into the future club as well. Oh yeah, yeah, I've been, I've been flying. It's been, uh, that was a good news that and and I thought George was good today. I thought he played with some composure, and I think he'd been a bit over the last few weeks. He'd been making wrong choices today. He, was, he, he knew what he wanted to do, and you know I don't mind him running against Attle and being patient. I thought he did some good things, George. So you could tell a weight's been lifted off his uh, off his shoulders. Could you see that, Sean? Yeah, he weren't playing. He weren't nowhere near to his standard, um, and I think that was pretty obvious today. The way he played, he played with some composure. So, really happy what uh, Ian and Chris have done there, getting him tied down. Great for rugby league and Super League, and more importantly, Wigan. Anybody injured? Everyone okay for Monday? Yep, yeah. all good. Uh, whether I'll risk Mickey or Lockers on Monday, I'll, I'll have a check in the morning, reduce some recovery, and I'll get him working to do a review tomorrow and say, yeah, but. Um, but we've also got Roman and, and Joe Bredton and Nick Gregson and all them players to come back. Good. Yeah, he has to come off after 12 minutes in second half, which is not like him. Um, but he wanted to go on at the end of the game. So I thought his movement was good. I thought his quality of his skill was good. So very happy having Mickey back. That's one of the biggest positives today. Why do you put him back on then? My physio would have killed me. Because she didn't want him to play today. I overruled her. Sean, all your five tries were down that left side. Is that something that's pleasing you particularly or just something you think was just a quiz? No, no, it's just a game by game, that. Yeah. game. You know, we, we had a certain play and um, we worked very hard on that in the detail. And, you know, it messed us about when they lost Johnny Lomax and, you know, because of certain things, what he does and what we can hopefully break him down. But, you know, I th I, I, down that edge was good today. I thought the skill was good and... Um, 
There's just a few areas in our attack where we can be a bit more patient and um, just ask a few more questions at certain times. But overall, very happy. All good?